Hey guys, welcome to Ham Radio with K0PIR and my YouTube channel. So do you have a couple of radios hooked up to your computer and you keep getting the USB audio codecs mixed up? Because uh, I've got both my radios connected to my computer with, uh, with the USB cables and I, I get the sound, cards, uh, the sound cards mixed up. Let me show you how I, I fix that. Okay, I guess the first thing we can do is go into the sound settings. Now I'm using uh, Windows 10. Go down here and hover my mouse over the speaker and then right click on it. And then left click on sounds. It's going to bring up the sounds properties uh, window here. We're going to go over to playback. And uh, I've already got it named, the ICOM 7610, that's a USB audio codec, and that's on 3. And then uh, the K3S USB audio codec, and that's on 4. So let me show you how I changed the name of it. I'll just select it, and then go to Properties, and then just type in, uh, type in the, the name that you want. Click OK. And that's set up for both the playback. You have to set them up each. I'll have to do this one. I had to do that one. Go over here to the recording tab. I do the same thing there and there. I can uh, I can rename this one here. This is my Blue Yeti. So I'm just going to go down to Properties. And uh, Blue, I'll just type Blue in there. And click OK. And so I've got that a uh, little bit more detailed, and uh, that does help. So I'm going to go ahead and hit hit OK. Now, when you go into your software, I'm I'm using uh, HRD, and like I said, I've got a couple of radios. So let me show you how I got it set up. I've got both my radios, and they're in a preset because I've connected to them successfully. And the uh, Elecraft uh, K3 is on COM3, and the 7610 is COM4. So I want to open up Digital Master and HRD Logbook, and I'll show you how I have them separated in Digital Master, because that's where I was running into some confusion, uh, get them mixed up, until I named them, and uh, it's been okay since then. So let me go ahead and hit Connect. And Digital Master 780, I went ahead and I set up another identity. Or I've got three identities, one for the K3, one for the 7610, and then the main. So I'm going to select, select the K3. That's the radio that I've got on. And it's going to open up uh, DM780, and you'll see up here the input is the K3S microphone. The output is the K3S speaker. So I'll show you in Program Options. Go over to sound card, and uh, there I just selected the appropriate one. I'm on the K3 right now, so I selected it, closed it out. Now, uh, when I change over to the ICOM 7610, I'll show you what I do. Let's go ahead and close all these out. So that was the uh, that was the K3. I'll power that off. Power on the 7610. Switch the antenna over. And go to connect. We've got the 7610 here. And I want to open up the Digital Master and HRD logbook. Go ahead and click connect. And then let's go over to this identity. Click continue. And you'll see the uh, radio pops up correctly uh, in the, over here, the radio pane. Uh, it's uh, the 7610. And uh, unfortunately, it does uh, go back to the last used sound card. So uh, I thought that the identity would fix that, but evidently it doesn't. So I have to go back in and change it each time. So let's do that. Go back into the sound card. And I'm on the 7610, but it makes it real easy. 7610. And I can close it out. And you see it all started up real good. 
I'm on the wrong uh, frequency. Let me go down to a PSK. I'm on a PSK 31. So let's look for a frequency uh, 20 meters. Okay, so there you go. I wonder if that's a glitch in Digital Master 780 or not. Uh, maybe you just can't uh, set up different sound cards because when I uh, exit out, Now, let me go ahead and hit restart, and it'll ask me for an identity. I'm going to hit the K3, and let's see what it brings up for a sound card. Yep, it switched uh, switched over to the last one that I used, which was the 7610. So, uh, do you have a solution for this? What's the purpose of the identities if you can't change hardware? suppose you can change the macros and uh, that sort of thing, but how about the hardware? Please comment below, and if you got something out of this video, please give me a thumbs up. Remember to like, subscribe, and share. Also, tell your friends. 73 and good DX. I hope to see you on the waterfall.